with the dogs getting some exercise, I think, too. Good morning, Mike. Yeah, Sandra, this is unique. Uh, we've all heard of boot camps for humans, but how about boot camp for humans and dogs? It's called Leash Your Fitness, and we'll be right back and tell you all about it. Stay with us. Oh, look at that cute little guy. We'll be right back as Good Morning San Diego continues in a minute. Okie dokie, we are back on this Monday morning. Thanks for joining us. I love this story. Uh, my, Jacob <laughs> says to me the other day, Mom, Phoebo is fat. <laughs> Your dog. Our dog. Yeah. I'm like, you know, fat dog, fat family. I'm thinking it kind of one, you know. <laughs> yeah, sometimes. Well, there's an exercise. Uh, you can do it yourself. Team. And your dog. Yeah. Very nice. And Mike Castellucci is out of Tory Pines <laughs> Dog Park this morning. Hey, Mike. Holy yeah. cow. Look at you. I've, I've got a lot of questions, uh, and we'll ask uh, Don, uh, the owner of Leash Your Fitness, about them. But, yeah, this is a class that they do every day, and, and what it is is it's exercise. Look at that big boy. Oh, look at that big, <laughs> I don't know if you can see it, a big bulldog type of guy. Uh, we'll get him over here. But what it is, is it's a, it's a fitness class for uh, humans and dogs. Now, I don't know if, do now dogs do need uh, exercise. In fact, uh, you know, it, it's widely known that uh, before affection, uh, dogs need a purpose. And uh, you need to be, uh, you know, that pack leader. And uh, Don uh, is here. Don, uh, you started this. Leash Your Fitness. It's a boot camp for humans and dogs. Right. It's yeah. a boot camp class for humans and dogs. And you can keep going. <laughs> um, you got to keep the whip cracking, you know, don't you? Well, okay, well, the problem is when people just take their dogs for a walk, they're not getting any upper body strength training. They're not getting core. They're not getting balance. They're not getting yoga. They're not getting any of that kind of stuff. Uh -huh. So what we do is we incorporate everything into a one-hour class. Wow. And, we, and we have everyone from 18-year-olds. We have marathon runners. We have um, Norma here. She's 80. 80. So we, have, we, we tailor the class for whatever fitness needs the people need. All right. Now look at this big guy right here. Uh, he he need does he need some fitness? Oh yeah, he needs some fitness. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and and we have we work with dog trainers, so the dog trainers help because we do incorporate the dog obedience also. Uh -huh. So we have them, we have the person hold their lunge, and the dog will be in whatever command. And Colleen here from oh, Potopia, she helps them with the dog obedience. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, and then they and they do get exercise also. Yeah, and we incorporate agility as you can see, and we help them with the jumps and all that kind of stuff. And like I said, if somebody, it's not, if it's not too much for, if it's too much for one person, then yeah. they can walk it. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, thanks, Don. Uh, we're going to come back, uh, Dan and Sandra, next hour and, uh, and, uh, and talk to these folks about it. You know, they come to these classes every day, and, uh, and the dogs, they, they seem to love it. Uh, I don't have a dog. Where's my dog? You know, I have three beagles, but uh, they don't get up until 9, and then they have their pedicure and then the uh, rub down. Oh, wait a minute. That's the Housewives of Orange County. I'm getting them confused. But anyway, we'll be back in about 20 minutes and, uh, and talk to Don a little bit more. Leash your fitness. It's the newest craze. We'll Very send it cool. Back to you. you know, people love their dogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yes. Get out Indeed. there and have a good time. Working out together. Yeah. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, Michael. Lucci having fun with the dogs. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. If you uh, go to yoga, you know Down Dog, but uh, you know who could do those the best? Dogs. And humans actually here at uh, Leash Your Fitness. We'll talk to you about it and tell you what it's all about coming up. Stay with us. We'll be right back. It doesn't matter what I say. That today he is uh, with a lot of dogs and a lot of um, very motivated women who are exercising those dogs. Good morning, Mike. Yeah, good morning, Sandra. Uh, this is a, a, it's the newest thing. You know, we've seen the boot camps out uh, before the sun comes up at several parks around town. At least I have when you get up that early. Uh, but this one is different. Uh, it's for a workout for you and your pooch. And uh, Don Celepino here with Jack. Jack, is, is that your inspiration for Jack starting this? my inspiration. Yeah. I started this class a year ago because I got Jack five years ago. Uh -huh. I'm a personal trainer, and after I got Jack, I didn't want to go to the gym anymore. I wanted to do all my workouts outside. Oh, look, so that, that I started doing perfect. my workouts outside and incorporating him in my workouts. Perfect sense. Uh, and, and so they do all kinds of things. You know, your dog, uh, we've heard it over and over, before affection uh, needs exercise and discipline. And does this provide it? I mean, right now, actually, they've gone from uh, jumping around to on the mats. And they're yeah. doing the plank right now, a yoga position. And the dogs are in a down position. 
Right. What we do is we incorporate cardio, upper body strength, core, yoga, balance, dog agility, and dog obedience. So Colleen here is from Potopia. She helps the dogs with the dog obedience part. This mat work is only one minute. As soon as the oh. one minute is over, they get up and they go do their cardio again. Oh, is that right? So we tire the dogs out. Okay, very good. So it's a it's a, a cross between everything. Now look how good this dog. And look, you're in a plank right there, and your dog's just sitting. Now see, it looks like you're doing the work, and the dog's just sitting doing there. The work. Oh, oh, hello. oh, sorry to get you out of a down. Uh, but uh, so this is a chance for the dog to. The dog doesn't need the ab work, does it? No, he's good. Yeah. <laughs> but he likes the agility part. But I do. <laughs> So you do that, the dog sits there, and then uh, he, you get up and he does the agility. He does. All right. Look, and look at the 80 years. Of, I could say your age, right? You could say because it. Because you, you told me. All right, and, and look, I just wanted to let you know, it's a little chilly out here, but she's in, in short sleeves. You know why? She's from uh, Pittsburgh. Yeah. So just visiting. For, is it warm? No, it was cold. But are you warm now? Oh, I'm fine. Yeah. I'm okay. Fine. Very good. And the little dog yeah. just standing there, and the and the dogs here. Very good. I think this is a great idea. Leash your fitness. It's called. You could find them at leashyourfitness.com or on our website, kusi.com, and we'll link you to it. Look at that. Uh, that's impressive. And you do this every day. We do it every day, but um, except for Monday and Saturday. Yeah. Okay. So we are on Sunday mornings at 9, and then every mornings, and we have two evening classes at Mission Bay. Different areas around town? Yeah, we're at four locations now. We started out with just one, but we're expanding to four different locations, Coronado, East County, and um, Mission Bay, and Carmel Valley. Very good. Well, they, uh, Dan and Sandra, they know how to do the down dogs. I'm not talking about the humans. <laughs> uh, so we'll, uh, we'll see you later. All right. It's a fun way to uh, work out outside, too. Mike, thank Absolutely. you. All right. <laughs> see you later. Morning. Hanging with the dogs, doing a little fitness, Mike. Hey, yes. That's right, about as far away from politics as you can get. It's called Leash Your Fitness. It's a boot camp for dogs and humans, and we're wrapping up class. They're off of the mat. We'll be right back. A dog's life. Fit. It's a good life. They're fit out there at Torrey Pines. <laughs> and pampered. They're at a boot camp, I guess you could say. Yes, they are. And Mike <laughs> is out there at boot camp as well. Are they training you or are you training them, Mike? Yeah, I'm not quite yeah. clear on that. <laughs> no. uh, that's right. It's, it's a boot camp for uh, dogs and humans alike. Uh, actually, uh, thought up uh, Leash Your Fitness uh, because you were a personal trainer, but uh, then you didn't want to go to the gym after you uh, no, got the pooch. Who wants to leave their dog at home, yeah. you know, and then you feel bad, and just taking them for a walk, you don't get a good enough workout, yeah. I don't think. But, I mean, it's better than nothing, but we incorporate everything in the one hour. And it's for all fitness levels. 80-year-olds, yeah. can, they can walk the course, and then it's really fun watching them get stronger. Sure. And then marathon runners, it gives them cross training so Absolutely. that we do the yoga and everything. But it is a great workout for the person. A lot of people just think it's for the dogs, but it's actually for both. Absolutely. Very good. And uh, as we leave you, Dan and Sandra, her dog, it's Toto, who has gone blonde. Uh, it's actually Jack. Cute little dog. We'll uh, send it back to you. Uh, and your little dog, too. There's no place <laughs> like home, Toto. You got it. <laughs> we'll see you, see you tomorrow. All Thank right. you, Michael. Enjoy your we'll day. We'll see you then. And thanks so much for looking our way. Make it a great Monday, everybody. Yep, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. Have a good one. Tell me